No, man. We're always in the same area code in our hearts. Welcome back to Painfully Average Gaming. We are back with Rainbow Six Siege. And then s Ew. silence. <laughs> <laughs> way, to, way to be peppy at the start, guys. Feeling that feeling that pep. Hey, I, jump, I jumped in eventually. I'm very into it, man. <laughs> Eventually. Yeah, Justin's a little tired for everybody. He's he's being a big baby about working night shifts today. <laughs> big baby my ass. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the triumphant return to Rainbow Six since um, last time was our very first ever playthrough of this. A um, little We've bit more experience now. Definitely gotten marginally better. <laughs> I wouldn't <laughs> That's, say that. That's pushing it. We've played more. Marginally, yeah. man. Doesn't I, have to be a big margin. <laughs> yeah. Maybe not any improvements gameplay-wise uh, on our end, but, uh, you know, we try. <laughs> we have more characters, if that makes us seem better. <laughs> we've we've done stuff. Damn it. Drop the fucking barbed wire. There we go. Is Where this is an actual... Like, or, or, Why are they not in, I didn't, in here? Because people don't like to do that. They like to hang outside of the room and die, apparently. Pussies. Fucking hard-ass McGillicuddy out there. Sharp antelope. I hate that I can't change characters 52. during the middle of the match. <laughs> oh, Justin. what the fuck was that <laughs> shit? <laughs> you walked right in front of me shooting, dude. You fucking killed me! I Why probably. Are you, are you both God dead? damn it. Oh, I'm nah, dead. I think I think the other guy got you, but you walked right in front of me, and I uh, definitely <laughs> hurt you. As you can tell, we're not I any thought. better at this game. <laughs> <laughs> if anything, we got marginally worse based on that. Well, that that yeah, answered that my great. question of uh, whether or not we were playing online, like against other people, or if we were just doing terrorist. Yeah, right? dude. Uh, <laughs> no, we're online. You should have realized yes. that by all the other people around us. Well, you can still do matchmaking for just regular terrorist type, yeah. so... Yeah, I'm gonna go... No, I don't want Ash. Who... Um, oh, you son Alfredo. of a bitch. You picked uh, Fuse. <laughs> Alfredo kills it with Ash. Right, I'm gonna go with... Sledge. My Sledge. boy Sledge. Holding it down with Sledge. Fuse is bae. Ow. Tyler fucking oh, stole him. him from me. Sure did. <laughs> Mr. Steal your fuse. Oh, I love uh I love the fact that uh nobody got to see Justin play this game in the last recording. Oh so, yeah. Uh, so You're now start everyone's out pretty decent, Justin. No. Just so everyone knows. No. Um <laughs> no. just so everyone knows <laughs> Justin has played this game with us just cuz he didn't get to record with us last time. So um the fact that he that, sucks that doesn't mean the fact that he yeah, the fact that he have, sucks is just because he sucks at the game. Yeah. <laughs> have very, very elevated expectations of him. I'm yeah, that way Olympic you can be... I'm athlete type of expectations. <laughs> that way you can be very disappointed. <laughs> oh, trust no, me, man. they're gonna be Justin's disappointed. Justin's gonna carry the team. You fucking is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Justin's the fucking backpack of the group. <laughs> Fucking Holy incorrect, fuck, dude. sir. Fuse is slow. Oh, I'm gonna have to mute that. I just knocked the shit out of my microphone. <laughs> uh, Idiot. Yeah, fuse is fuse is fucking heavy, man. He's slow but he's as worth shit. it. I feel like Sledge I'm used to is playing Destiny. Right Everybody now. is so slow. Yeah, that's very true. We've been playing yeah. Destiny too. Um, for those of you who don't, well, how would you know? We haven't recorded that. Um, yeah. Great no game. Wants to watch Destiny. I'm dead. Yeah, which which is sad, but I can understand the <laughs> the not wanting to see spoilers. I see Go your dead body, Justin. <laughs> Gooey butt grease killed me. Butt <laughs> 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 grease. That's so gross. That's such a good gamer tag, though. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Could you imagine so like people? People come up to him like, hey man, what's your gamer tag? And he's like, oh, it's gooey butt grease. You know. <laughs> oh, <I'm sorry>. What? <laughs> come again? Come again for big Gooey punch. with oh, a G. Uh, butt. Oh, I got a kill. Oh no, I killed our teammate. My <laughs> he you ran in front of me. Just 
He ran in front of me, dude. You killed the sharp antelope. To get into. Well, then I died oh. trying to kill the guy that I was trying to kill when he cut me off. Gotcha, so. bitch. <laughs> Notorious. The <laughs> I can't fucking see shit. And there, it's so dark. I can still look around from my car. <laughs> you dead. Oh, no! S give me three sausage killed me. Give me three <laughs> sausage. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we're seeing some good gamer people, tags though. tonight. I got two people, and one was a headshot internet. Huh? Ladies? Huh? <laughs> hey, Tyler, how'd Tyler's you meet your find wife? The love of his life on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, she was impressed by my That's siege only. skills. <laughs> hey, you you joke. That's the, that's the kind of woman I want. <laughs> <laughs> Someone that can, yeah, I, can play some siege with me and be like, damn, boy, you out here killing shit. And I'll be like, <laughs> that's what's up. You'd be like, girl, I'm going to marry you. Yeah, but in reality, she fucking beats your ass in this game every time. That's fine. <laughs> 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 she, she, she can electronically cuck me. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> oh, dude, you had him. Get the fuck in there. Stop being such a puss. Watch it. He's going to take your advice and go in, and he's going to immediately die. He's going to die immediately. Someone's going <laughs> to stab him in the back. To your right, dude. He crawled to the right. I thought he was going to kill the hostage for a second. <laughs> I, th I thought so, too. Just fucking boondock sign her ass. Oh. Oh, he got him. Fucking lucky just random firing into a room. Dude, I hope he if he would just grab there. the hostage and take off like that one guy did in that uh in that game we played a Box while it. back. <laughs> oh, <laughs> trash. <laughs> Give me three sausage. For the people that are contemplating playing this game, um, just know that this game is super hard to play online. Like it's one of those games you gotta nah, dude. You, you gotta get good at. <laughs> I think it's just that we suck you need at to it. Get good at. People can't be bought. <laughs> <laughs> Slavery Indeed is wrong. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's called the black market. <laughs> yeah, but when you fuck around with that, you get Liam Neeson coming after your ass. <laughs> We're gonna get tooken. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is this five or six? I've lost count. I've only oh, ever seen the yeah. first one. <laughs> Same. I uh, I kind of lost interest after that. I was like, man, this is a whole other movie about the Dude. same exact thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I saw the first and I was like, dope. Then I saw the second and I was like, literally the same thing just moderately different and then uh and then the third one came out and i just saw the trailer and i was like now nah, I'm, I'm gonna have to pass on that Did, didn't he get taken in the third one no he no he's always the savior oh i thought he i thought he got taken in one of them i don't know i thought they he like could flipped it on his head <laughs> How do you know when a movie franchise has jumped the shark? The hero's the taken one. You just see, like, it's his daughter going to rescue him this time. <laughs> and she gets on the phone, and she's like, I have yeah. absolutely no skills. Yeah, but I'm going to try, like, really super hard, and I really hope you guys will respect my effort. <laughs> what's his, and then, what's like, his daughter's name? Is it, oh, I, I don't like, remember. If he just like calls her and he's like, Miranda, I need you to come get me. And she's just she's just like, where are you? They killed the fucking hostage. Just like, <laughs> just like, doesn't matter where I am. I don't know where I am. Come find me. <laughs> do something. Are you are you going to be able to do that? And then she's just like, yes, bitch, leave me alone. I'll come get you. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I, I think... Really, no one's allowed to kill the hostage. I think if we kill her, it's no. it's game over. So, uh, which doesn't make sense. I mean, we're we're terrible. Well, it makes sense because we're trying to get something out of it. 
I was about to say we lose our leverage at that point. Yeah. Like the movie Taken would have probably been a lot shorter if uh, they had just killed the daughter. <laughs> just like yeah, but they were we shot to your learn to sex slavery. Yeah, but once he starts coming for her, you know, you'd think after so many casualties, they'd be like, "This isn't worth it," and they just shoot her, and then like it would cut to Liam Neeson no. just being like, "Damn it!" And then like the movie would end, like roll the credits. No, because then after so many casualties, it's a personal thing. I mean, I guess you're right. I, wasn't that what the second one was about? Wasn't it a personal thing Probably. because he killed they, so many people? I think I think that sounds. I think right. so because they they took the daughter and wife in the second one, I believe. Ex-wife. Again, I believe it was ex-wife. Didn't fucking watch it. It doesn't matter. So the, <laughs> so the daughter got movie. took in the first one and the second one. Fuck her, right? I think so. I mean, shit, oh, that's gotta be horrible. <laughs> I mean, get smarter, though. <laughs> the third movie, Homeboy just told like. You to be safe. <laughs> the third movie, like, opening scene is just Liam Neeson in her face, just like, quit it! You quit it! <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's, it's like, uh. Like, Deadpool nailed my reaction for the third one, where he's like, at some point, it's just like something about you're just being a bad parent. <laughs> Yeah, that's very true. Because it's like, it's like your daughter just gets fucking scooped up by people constantly. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> ah. Yeah, I killed a guy. <laughs> Me and Justin doing stuff. <laughs> I just tried to kill someone with the fucking breaching charge. Didn't work. Get good. Aren't Ow. Get I'm getting good. shot in the ass. Aren't they supposed to be the defending the hostage? <laughs> yeah, but they're all out there. I was about to say, this guy was just running through the map like it's Kill Call of Duty guy. or something. Nice, look at Justin. Everyone yeah, keep, those, uh, keep those expectations high. <laughs> Dude, I told you, fucking backpack over here. <laughs> they call me backpack. <laughs> they call me Jansport. <laughs> I'm probably going to kill the hostage, the mummy. but I'm going to try this oh, anyways. This is festive. We're in a haunted house. I, it's dude, October. I don't know if I, you I didn't even I'm know it was October. House. I didn't Did even know not? it was October the other day. Yeah, just somebody was like, oh, it's October. And I was like, what? I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck me then. I was ready to celebrate 4th of July this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> When did that legit, happen? Like when did when did what happen, man? Time. <laughs> <laughs> I legit thought it was still September the other day. Well, I mean, it's only the fourth, so you're not you're not too far off. Yeah. Oh yeah, it is the fourth. Oh, I'm thinking about uh, taking those, those the boys shifts, to their. Uh, hey, fuck you up, yeah, dude. I'm thinking about it's, it's horrible. Do you, do you think Matthew and Noah are at the appropriate age to go to their first haunted house? <laughs> what kind of Or do you think house? they're still at, like, traumatizing Matthew, level? Matthew, Matthew could probably go to a haunted house that isn't really that scary. Oh, fuck Noah me. would probably die. <laughs> the thing is, though, like, Noah gets so terrified at scary stuff, but he loves it. Like, he absolutely loves it. <laughs> he just I, tries I don't to run. run. <laughs> he freaks out, man. <laughs> he freaks out. I bad. mean, that would be something I'd say leave up to them. If they bring something up to you, take them. If not, don't take them. Because then, if you take count. them to one and then they shit themselves and like have little mini heart attacks, uh, you're the asshole. <laughs> <laughs> you're the bad. That's very bad. true. Daddy, I don't want to go. Like, just just hush and hug that guy with the chainsaw. Shut up, boy! You're going. <laughs> <laughs> Quit being such a little bitch. When I was your age, I'd done poop my pants twice in the same night. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. There, last time I experienced a Halloween in Alabama, I scared the shit out of Kyle. Did you? What, yeah, dude. What, what we were happened? at your house, and we were 
We were um, going to go to the haunted house at the church across the street. It was when you were on Main Street. And yeah. uh, you ran outside for some reason, started running around your house, and I was in my sweet glow-in-the-dark skeleton outfit, and I ran the other way. And we turned the corner at the same time, and you just went straight to your back. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I do remember that. <laughs> I remember... It um, was like, ah! <laughs> so we had some fun when you guys... Holy. Well... Anytime we, we were in the same area code, we had a good time. <laughs> when are we not in the same area code? Right now, actually. <laughs> no, man. We're always in the same area code in our hearts. <laughs> I'm going to open that That'd episode. That would be the gayest I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> One time we went to a haunted corn maze when I was a kid, and I took one of my friends and my brother and some of his friends, and my, my mom took us. And uh, when we got there, my friend that I brought, he's been a little scaredy ass bitch and wouldn't go in. So me and my <coughs> mom sat outside in the car with him, and uh, I don't remember who it was, Michael Myers or somebody, I don't know. They had heard about uh, him not wanting to go in, so the motherfucker came and like jumped on top of the car and was like jumping all over <laughs> it and all kind of shit. <laughs> And my friend was in, like, the back seat just sitting there crying and screaming. And my little badass self, I was, like, eight years old, so I was cussing the damn guy out. You were a badass little get, kid. Get the fuck out of the car! Get I was, a, I was a horrible the kid. That, 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 that was about it. Yeah. I'll fight my, you! I was trying to protect my little friend, man. <laughs> Fuck off, Michael Myers! I'll kick alone. you in the nuts. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker was like screaming and crying like a little bitch. Dude, that's like the worst mistake you can make Don't at a worry, haunted Steve, house. I got this. Is letting Let them know, know that you're scared. scared. Yeah, because yeah, they will mess with you so much harder. <laughs> Dude, I went to a Ripley's, believe it or not, haunted house in uh, Nashville. I think it was, or maybe it was Knoxville. I think it was Knoxville. Fucking terrifying. It was like pitch black, and they, uh, they're they like, oh, you can buy this thing. It's the only uh, form of light you can have in the haunted house. And I was like, yeah, sure, why not? does absolutely fucking nothing. It lights up about <laughs> um, maybe a centimeter away from you, and that's it. And then uh, it's just pitch black, and everyone had to walk in a line and hold on to each other and like feel your way through. And then people uh, would just pop up behind you and scream in your fucking ear and shit. And then you get squeezed through these, like, it was almost like bed sheets. Like, you walk between two bed sheets that are, like, blown out toward you. So you're walking through, and on the other side of the bed sheets are people just, like, rubbing you. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yes, senpai. And then. Yeah, that sounded the, sexual the worst as fuck. Part, well, well, they're, like. Like, they're just like touching you to freak you out and shit but like the worst part by oh fuck i reloaded at the wrong time the worst part by far is at the end of it you uh get on the elevator to leave and then uh it's like all normal lights are back on everyone's like oh that was fucking terrifying blah 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 and then the doors of the elevator open up a fucking skeleton thing just shoots out toward you and scares the living shit out of you and it's just like one last like, oh hey, here we go, we're off, <gasps> bam, and then everyone like pissed all over the fucking elevator floor. Some dude had to come <laughs> clean it up. Oh man, uh, the scariest one I've been it to. It was all my piss. Um, I don't know. As a kid, I was more terrified of them, but uh, as an adult, I, I'm kind of numb to most of that. Like I, I kind of go into one knowing what to expect. Um. The best one is the one that's down... Rest I in think, peace, Chester. I think it's in Leeds, Alabama. I can't remember the name of that. It's not Aatrox. It's the in other Leeds. popular one around here. Um, Aatrox sorry. is sorry. Leeds. Is it Aatrox? No, Aatrox is... Isn't that the one in Birmingham? The Fear Not Birmingham. It's Lost Sprite Furnace. Oh, okay. So I guess it is Aatrox. Um, Sorry to that organization for not remembering their name. They haven't started <laughs> advertising every thirty seconds this year. Yet. That's a really that's actually <laughs> a really nice place. They have like the guy that comes from uh, that played Freddy Krueger in the original movie. He comes and does signings and all kind of shit. Yeah, have all kind um, of people come. That's cool. Last time I went, I got to meet the 
she was in The Walking Dead. It was like the zombie in the very first episode that was in the park that was all torn in half. I got to meet the girl that yeah, played that zombie. Yeah, half crawling. Yeah, um, I got to meet her, <laughs> which was pretty cool. Um, but that haunted house is is pretty legit. Like they they mess with your phobias and stuff. Like they have um, one section. It's like a hallway, and they have like what I can only describe as like bouncy houses blown up on the sides, and you have to like squeeze through it. I mean, when I say squeeze, you you've got to like suck in and push to get through it. And there was people like having breakdowns and shit. Like it was cool. Um, I uh, I went through it with uh, the girlfriend I had at the time, and uh, I remember at one point I thought it was her that was holding my hand. <laughs> I got further on into <laughs> another room, and uh, else. yeah, it was like a girl wearing like a porcelain doll mask, and like <laughs> oh <laughs> no, I'm out. yeah, dude, freak. I'm gone freaked me out so bad because she didn't she didn't say a word or do anything she just like grabbed my hand and was just walking with me and then oh, like I God. turned and when I turned she screamed in my face dude that's <laughs> no, I'd be crying dude, I was on the terrified <laughs> yeah I was terrified I've been crying now dude you, you don't want to throw a punch uh that's like the worst thing you can do those actors are there to do that yeah, you, you know and um no but fucking everybody course, rag on Justin yeah, for real. Um, but when I was there last time, I watched probably like six people get arrested for doing that. Like just in the time that I was waiting in line, like it's like, really, people? <laughs> you, you know what you're there Let's for? Chill the fuck out. Like, well, it's not like I it's feel intentional. Like it, I I believe it's, it is. Mm, it's, I think it's a little bit. Yeah, I do too. Um, because of, like, pe- you'll say like, oh, fight or flight, but it's like. You willingly went to a fucking haunted house. You you know what you're walking into. Yeah, you went there to get scared by these people. You you know what's about yeah. to happen. Um, what's sad about it was uh, the people that were throwing the punches, apparently, that were in trouble with the cops. I think I seen maybe two girls, and the rest were all dudes. Like, that was... I was like, really? <laughs> you guys You guys should should do better than that that that's not a Ooh, got a nice. manly stance <laughs> uh, I got someone in that room oh i found somebody Kyle, do, do you remember going to, oh uh, fuck Sloth me Jesus furnace? Christ. we all went together i do remember that actually it was a fun time i just um i didn't find the haunted house to really be that scary yeah, i it was think like Sloth needs party to outside yeah, man, they had like fire oh, jugglers lame. and all kinds of shit going out there. And that was really cool. Yeah, um, it was cool. It was a fun experience. I wouldn't say yeah, it's good, really definitely. scary, but it, it's still fun to go and be entertained. Um, that being said, Sloss, you need to you need to step your game up on the scariness. <laughs> I've, I've been there twice, and neither time was really that scary. Dude, one of the scariest haunted houses I went to, I think, was just because I was younger. Um, it might have been that church one too, across from your house. Yeah. Uh, it was just one scary moment where I was like running with my mom, um, and she was like holding my hand, and I look back, and it's this long, like really fluorescent hallway that was like the lights were flickering, and it was like curved, and I looked back, and I saw someone chasing us, and I was freaking out, and then we kept running and I look back again and there was no one there and I could not have been more scared (laughs) I was like where the fuck did that guy just go I was like he was there (laughs) and then Um, like when we came out of it someone chases you with a fucking chainsaw I was like fuck you I thought I was safe that that is the that is the worst as a child especially because like there's just something about chainsaws yeah. when you're a kid that it's just so terrifying. It's it's still scary as yeah, an adult. Yeah. I still don't like it. It it's still just, jars it's, it's me. It's loud but... and it's a sound that you know you're not supposed to hear close to you. Yeah, that's, that's very true. Very accurate. Oh God, it doesn't it. bother me because oh. you know it doesn't have a damn uh, what is it a chain? What do they call it? a chain or a blade or whatever? You know it the doesn't chain. have the cutting part. Yeah, on they don't it. have the chain. Uh, but still. Yeah, it's still just scary, it's man. It's startling. But there was, um... <laughs> down here, I get the privilege of going to Halloween Horror Nights in Orlando. I'm jealous and, uh, of that. 
they got some scary shit. They have some really cool Walking Dead uh, haunted houses every year. Like, one time there was, uh, you went through Woodbury, and at one point the governor's, like, screaming for everyone to run through all the fences filled with zombies and shit. And then um, there was one that was terrifying, unexpectedly so. It was uh, Cabin in the Woods, which oh. is a great movie. It is and a great movie. It's, it's, it's a funny movie, too. Like, it makes fun of horror genre, really. And uh, I was not prepared for that. I was like, oh, is this going to be kind of funny? Or uh, is it actually going to be scary? It was maybe the most terrifying house there. Really? I'm yeah, uh, it, I was super jealous I didn't get to go me. to the, um, the what was it, the Silent Hill themed one? Yeah, that was the yeah. that same year, dude. That was fucking terrifying, too. Yeah, I uh, I think it, it came the same out year in, as like, in the woods. It, they promoted it in some kind of gaming magazine that I read that year. And I was like, oh, my God, I want to go to that so bad. But I was only, like, I, I think I was just 18. Oh, fuck. And I could not afford to do so. so <laughs> okay. Yeah, I went with my uh, girlfriend of the time. And who was that shit scary? <laughs> It looked so good because in the magazine they had like, like set pieces that they were showing off. Yeah, dude. Uh, yeah. yeah, and like they have like uh, sh the street performers do scary shit too. Like uh, we gathered around because there was like a bunch of people already there, so we walked in and we saw some lady screaming at a bunch of uh, like female prisoners, like they were in hmm. orange jumpsuits, and um, orange is the new black. <laughs> yeah and then like out of nowhere she like blew this loud ass whistle every single one of them picked up a chainsaw cranked it up and just started running to the nearest people yeah fuck oh, I was God. like fuck <laughs> get the fuck out of here we dipped into the line for the mummy ride <laughs> <laughs> they'll never find us here we're safe <laughs> I was like we're in line for a ride we're good no, <laughs> no one's gonna chase us in here I really enjoyed Universal when I went. It's a great place. I need to it go. It's a great again. place. I would love to go for the first time. But with that, we're going to call this an episode. <laughs> it's a great place. I would love to go for the first time. <laughs> Fucking idiot. <laughs> End on a sad note. All right. Thank you, everybody. Yeah, we'll thank you everybody now. for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. Bye.